Hello and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Let's Build series in Minecraft. Now today I want to show you how to build this Acacia Mansion. As you can see it is a quite nice design. Now in this episode we are going to build the exterior. As you can see the sides look lovely as well. We are going to have two entrances so the other side looks exactly like this one. And this side looks lovely as well i see that i forgot some iron bars now in today's episode i will show you the exterior and in the next one we are going to build the interior as well so if you have suggestions for the interior let me know in the comment section the requirements for this tutorial is actually everything you see right here the amounts are exact uh because you know i didn't remove any block after i placed it so these are actually the correct numbers. And now one thing I want to mention is that the lightning rod is optional. So keep that in mind. So let me slowly go down and you can just pause if you want to and gather all of these materials except for the leather. Now, once you got that, let's get to building. The first thing what we are going to do is we are going to outline this build and then we are going to get the first floor and the second floor afterwards. Okay, so you want to start and we are going to build from to from left to the right. So keep that in mind. So place a block right here to start with. Then you can add a acacia wood, skip six blocks. And then add another one right there. Then you want to add a block. After that, we're going to build the entrance. Now the entrance is going to be two doors wide. So keep that in mind as well. Then you can repeat this on this side. So the block here, skip six blocks. And then add another one right there. Okay, for this side. And the other side, what you want to do is add three blocks here. And then a deep slay block, add four blocks, deep slay block, and then after you got this in, what you want to do is repeat this one more time, and then add three blocks, like we did right here. And then you can just go back, like we did here, and just connect the sides together. After you got that, it should end up looking like this. Now you can decide which one you, you are going to use as your main entrance because we are going to have two entrances for this one. Next up, we are going to get the pillars in. Now for the front side and these blocks, what you want to do is make it five blocks high. So one, two, three, four, five. Do the same over on this side this one and of course for these two as well like that okay then you want to make sure that this is as high as this as well so you will add, you want to add some planks to break up this design a little bit then go over it and close it like that then you want to make sure that these are five blocks high as well. Okay. You want to place a block behind this one and go back. And this is actually where the second floor is going to start. So you want to build up here, make a window which is two blocks wide, one wide, and then again two. Then you can just build this up five blocks one two three four five then go back till this point okay now the reason why i show you this side because the remaining sides are going to look exactly the same okay let's move on uh, now before we go further you want to make sure that this side looks exactly like this one and then for the sides, what you want to do is actually quite simple. You want to build this up, do the same thing over on this side. 
and these are going to be 10 blocks high like that then you want to add some stairs one here one going this way add a bank on top of that and then you can add acacia wood planks here you want to add some stairs again with some planks on top okay that's going to be the basic shape for the sides this is going to look like this so what you want to do is get this side in and all the remaining sides as well and after that we are going to uh, continue decorating this now once you cut all these sides in it should look like this i actually forgot some pillars but that's fine well it doesn't look impressive right now so let's change that a little bit uh first thing i want to show you how to decorate these windows and after that we are going to get the well little garage thing in with the entrance and all the fun stuff so keep that in mind what you want to do for these windows is actually quite simple you want to add some planks going like that and then you want to add some stairs uh, not there only on these two white windows on the one white window you can just add a acacia slab let's do that quickly as well okay like that then uh what you want to do is fill this in with some iron blocks so let's start actually with that and you want to go in one block okay and you can fill this in do the same thing over on that side as well now once you got all these sides in and the windows as well what we're going to do is we're going to decorate it and like i said this side is going to look exactly the same as this and these two sides and this is going to be exactly the same like all the remaining four sides and then i will show you the one side of this and it's going to be exactly the same again now what we're going to do is you want to add some stairs first so let's start with that one and you can use some blackstone or some dip slate doesn't matter and you want to add some slabs uh, stairs on these sides then herefore you want to add a lightning rod if you don't want to you can just add defenses it will be fine so don't worry about that then on top of this what you want to do is add a row of stairs and there's a slight change we need to make because i have added one row of iron blocks too much so let's add this going across then you want to take some fences and place them like that with some buttons then on these sides you can add some stairs with some buttons on top take out these blocks place a sea lantern then you can make a chain going up and optionally you can add even end rods to this point if you want to but i don't think it's necessary though okay let's get this quickly in then uh, to finish this side off what you want to do is add some acacia slabs going across like this now before we continue uh just do the same thing over on that side and then we're going to get the entrance and the second floor in as well like i mentioned once you got this side in we are going to get the entrance in as well so you want to start off by building this up 10 blocks in total so this is five six seven eight nine ten now you can mix the deep sleigh i think that will look much better so keep that in mind and if you want to mix up some the some of these then you want to get the doors in add some stairs like this then you want to add three rows of planks one two three let's do the same and actually you can just build this up already doesn't matter do the same over on this side then we will have another window right here so add two stairs again then two rows of planks 
at a fence, a dark oak fence actually, right here. On top of this, you want to add some stairs. Let's go this, like that. Then if you have it, some ladders will look very nice as well. Then you want to add some iron bars, but before that add some stairs and then iron bars going across and up. Okay, right here we are going to add some cobblestone to indicate that this is going to be the start for the roof as well. Okay, then you can add some fences again. Okay, that's going to be the basic shape for the entrance. Add some planks going across. After that, you want to take some trapdoors and iron bars. And you want to follow this line, so let's actually add stairs to make it easier. Then add iron bars right here. Okay. Then you can just go back. That's going to be the basic shape for this side and this side as well. Now, we got the empty space right here. So what you want to do is just fill this in simply like so. Then you want to take some stairs and place that in going across and up. Okay. Then add some stairs on these edges and now you want to add some deep sleigh stairs uh, slabs instead of the acacia okay. so that's going to indicate the roof for us to decorate uh, let's actually do this side why not this side uh, you want to add stairs here you want to do the same shape as this so add a end rod here a uh, lightning rod here we go then you can add some stairs going across with some slabs and you want to keep these sides out so it gives it a edge okay and here we go that's actually the basic shape for this side now we want to add some dark oak woods. Let's add the blackstone as well. Then you want to add carpets. I'm going to use white carpet. I think it gives it a little bit a uh, contrast in between, you know, the colors. So that's why. After you got all of that in, you want to add some trapdoors going on the edge here you want to add some trapdoors as well so that nothing can go in okay uh, repeat that on this side as well once you got this side in as well it should end up looking like this now what we're going to do is we're going to decorate the sides as well so what i will do is show you this side and all of these are going to look exactly the same so that's why I will show you one side only. Now add some acacia stairs upside down like that. On top of this, you want to add some stairs as well. Of course, uh, you want to follow this pattern with some slabs. On top of this, you want to do the same thing like that. Here, you want to add stairs like this. And on top of this, you want to add the deep sleigh going across. Then you can take some lanterns and place that in if you want to. It's not necessary. And then you can add the trapdoors. Uh, let's actually add it here as well. Going in front of it like this. Okay, now for the pillars, of course, we are going to follow this shape. So let's add the lightning rods and then you want to add some fences going up and up here you can add another one if you want to but i will keep it as fence right for now then you want to take some iron bars and place it in like this 
Now you can use uh, fences if you want to. Acacia fences. But what I will definitely do is take some dark oak fence and get that in like this as well. Just to break up this design a little bit. Then here for you can add some fences to fill it in to give it some more depth as well. So what you want to do is get all the sides in and all the windows. I see you after that. Now once you got all these sides in, it should look like this. And I have to be honest, I really like how it ended up. Now to get the roof in, what we're going to do is we're going to add a row of cobblestone stairs first. And you want to go in one block and go all the way around. After you got one uh, one row in, what you want to do is take some planks and place it behind it so it's easier to get another row on top. Now the second row, you want to start mixing up the stairs actually. So what I will do is use the polished and the sides and the stone bricks with some cobblestone stairs and get the roof in. What I will do is get the roof in and I see you after that. And uh, one thing, uh, you want to go up six or seven rows. I'm not going to make a huge roof for this house. We got the roof in. What you want to do is add some leaves if you want to with some cobblestone. Uh, actually, it's the mossy cobblestone slab. Now, as you can see, I have done a roof which is six or seven blocks high. Uh, let's count one, two, three, four, five. Five rows high and on top a slab. Now, I think this looks nicely already, but in the next episode, we're going to decorate the inside of this house as well. So if you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comment section. I hope you all have a nice day. I see you the next time.